We farm uh, about 6,000 acres on an uh, own share farm on a contracted basis, uh, growing vegetables and, uh, and arable crops. Uh, on the carrots and parsnips we grow about 1,400 acres, uh, supplying UK with about 48 weeks UK production. The business has grown over the last uh, 30 years uh, significantly. Probably the biggest growth was when we started being involved with the retailers, uh, and particularly ASDA. We've worked for ASDA for 20 years, uh, and we've grown our business as they've grown with us. Everybody's looking for more food safety, everybody's looking for less residues in the crop, but they're also looking for value. And, and, and it's a quite a difficult balance to get the two because, you know, pesticides and new products deliver value. It's great to see a company bringing some innovation, although it might not be with a, a, an active uh, pesticide, it's another way of attacking our problems. And I think probably that is where the future lies. It isn't just about creating more and more chemistry. There are other ways of, of solving these problems and Nemgard has delivered that. Nematodes are very, very difficult to uh, detect in the soil and the level of nematodes in the field can vary very dramatically depending on the area of the field, the time of the year, the activity of the nematodes. So the actual testing for nematodes in carrots is relatively inaccurate as opposed to testing for sort of PCN in potatoes is proven technology. We've never successfully managed to test for nematodes uh, to a point where we probably look at applying none. One thing that is a big plus to us, particularly on the early crop, is of course it has a zero harvest interval. So we're not continually challenged about can we harvest a crop, is there a danger of a residue, has the residue disappeared out of the crop, etc. We can't just ignore what customers are asking. People want less pesticide in the food and we can't ignore that. So it's very important. I think it's great that companies come along with some alternatives to standard chemistry. We have a big selection process about what products we use and we never use any product, be it a natural product or a in a manufactured product without actually having a need to it. We never ever would do that. But uh, this product gives us the opportunity to use it use at any time uh, without the risk of residues and without the risk of harvest intervals. We worked with Nemgard, I don't know, at least 10 years, I think. But uh, there's been a lot of uh, development into, into the product since then. Farmer to farmer, it is it is just about as easy to use as a standard insecticide is now. We've now got a, a, a stage where the application rates are very similar, the application equipment is similar, so if we wanted to swap from one to the other, the, 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 the difficulties of doing that are not very big. We have got confidence in it. You, you've seen the NFU have just launched a leaflet called Healthy Harvest. It's making awareness to the lack of new pesticides coming forward, and particularly in carrots, uh, it, it's, uh, you know, which is a minority crop, it's very, very difficult to justify investment. But the great thing about this product is it's, it's attacking the problem from a different direction. It's not suddenly saying, let's create more chemistry and a new chemical to control something. It's a, it's a, it's a different way of attacking this, the same problem. Now, pesticides are a necessity in modern agriculture. You know, we've got a growing population, people want value, and with value, you've got to use some pesticides. You've got to look at more pesticides, you've got to look at GM, or you've got to look at alternatives, which, which, which Nemgard is an alternative. Make no mistake about it, we need a combination of these things to deliver volume and value. Typically, if, if they've got nematode damage, you'd see forking and fanging, and uh, uh, as you can see, the first dig, we've just not found any at all.